Hey, what's going on guys? I'm back again with another video. In this video, we are going to talk about how to register environment variables into your Laravel app and make them accessible throughout your application. Before we start our video, if you haven't subscribed my channel, please subscribe and hit the bell icon and select all so you can receive latest updates from us. Here is my Laravel app with the basic template. I just want to show some text here using my environment variable. Here is the file that contains all of the environment variables. So I just want to register a new one. Just press save. And now we can access this variable into our blade file. If I go to my welcome.blade.php and here I can see that uh, the Laravel title is here. Uh, if I just remove this and then refresh my page, we can see that the text is disappeared. And now we want to display the value of the variable that we just added. We can use env function here and just pass the key that, that we just created in our environment file that is here. And we can also pass some default value to this one. Default value. If we reload this page, we can see that it, it is only displaying the default value but not the actual uh, value from our environment file. The default value is from here. The page is showing this default value because uh, this variable is not accessible here currently. So we need to make it accessible. Just go to your project folder and in the path of your folder type in CMD and uh, it will open the directory to your project and then you are going to type php artisan and you are going to type config cache after executing this command you are going to clear your cache Okay, now if we reload our home page, we can see the updated value from our environment files. Okay, now we are going to try another variable. If we reload our page now, we can see that uh, our value from the variable is here. But this time we were not required to execute the clear command. Why? Because if you have uh, executed this command and uh, you are using your Laravel app, then every time you are going to add a new key into your environment file, uh, you have to execute this command and then this command. So what actually this command does? It actually stores all of your uh, environment variables and the configurations into a Laravel cache, uh, but it stores only the uh, keys but not their values. Because if you, if you update these values, uh, these are uh, accessible into your application. But if you add a new variable, uh, that is not accessible. So please remember that if you are running your project on your local host, you always execute this command uh, whenever you are going to install your application. So you are not having any problem in future. You can easily add new variables uh, into your environment file or you can also uh, make a new keys into your configuration files. Thank you guys for your love and support. If you have further queries, please comment below and hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, please subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss any update. Bye bye.